Hi everyone, we're going to simplify these rational expressions. These are actually complex rational expressions, especially number two. So we'll get started. Um, the first one, what I want to do is uh, deal with this denominator first. So I can write my y in fraction form, so that's going to be y over 1. So I'm going to have 3 over, and then if I just deal with this, just looking at that, my common denominator is x, so I'm going to put an x here, and you just do the butterfly um, thing. You do uh, 1 times 2 is 2, plus x times y is xy. Now basically what we have is 3, I'm going to put that in fraction form, 3 divided by 2 plus xy over x, and uh, what we're going to do is change that to 3 over 1. You keep, change, and flip, so that's x over 2 plus xy. And you just simply multiply across, you get 3x over 2 plus xy. Okay? Or what you could have done if you know this, how to do that, it's a little trick. You just move this x up there. You see it? That would have been 3x over 2 plus xy. Okay, and the next one, um, we're going to deal with the numerator first. So for the numerator, my common denominator is xy. So you do the butterfly and cross here. So that's ry plus rx. Whoops, rx. Okay, do the same thing for the denominator. Write my 1 in fraction form. My common denominator is y. And do the butterfly, so that's going to be y minus x. And again, this is like saying ry plus rx over xy divided by y minus x, uh, yeah, y minus x over y. So what we're going to do is we're going to keep, change to times, and flip this, y over y minus x. Okay, so let's distribute all that. So let's deal with the numerator. We have r y squared plus r x y over, let's multiply this, we get x y squared minus x y. And that's it. All right. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye. Actually, let's look at this real quick. On this one, we can, um, the numerator, just thought of that when I left. So this is, we can simplify this further. We can factor out a y here and a y here. So I'm going to factor out a y, and I get r y minus rx, and in the denominator, I can factor out a y, and I get xy minus x. In that case, the y's cancel. So, there is your final answer. My apologies. Thank you, and have a nice day. Bye-bye.